Basically, you can't trust the thing that's coming out of your computer because the monitor is changing the content of the screen. Hello, my name is Ang Sui. I am the founder and chief scientist of Red Balloon Security. Let's look at a typical embedded vulnerability and what it means. Here, we have a beautiful Dell 24-inch monitor. And if you look at this website, it's obviously a mock, not real website. What you probably have not thought about is that this monitor also has a computer inside the monitor itself that's responsible for displaying pixels and selecting input. It's generally called the on-screen display controller. Now, our research found that there is a way for an attacker to gain access to and cause arbitrary code execution inside the controller of the monitor itself. What if you can't trust the output of your computer because the monitor is actually changing the pixel values on the screen? So that's exactly what we did. If the attacker redirects you to a website that looks a lot like your banking website, uh, you're not gonna be able to see that same SSL lock on your browser. So this is where the attacker would then compromise your monitor and put that SSL lock onto the screen. We've made this SSL lock not move at all. It is possible to have this thing move with the, the browser, but for demonstration purpose, we've made it not follow the screens. So your computer is not showing you that your connection is secure, but the monitor is overlaying the SSL lock onto it. We can use the monitor itself to change what you see as in your bank account. So instead of having $100, we can make your monitor show that your bank account has a million dollars. There's no way for the user to know because we only interact with this computer through the monitor. We estimate that there's at least a billion monitors on the planet today that's vulnerable to this type of attack. What were you doing by my computer? I saw you behind the monitor. <laughs>